people believe that the material for an architect are stone, steel, concrete. It's true, but you have also light. The light shapes the space and also creates a sense of emotion. And architecture is fundamental art of creating emotion. Making a residential building in New York is very important, very interesting. Manhattan is a city of water in the sea. The building will take the color of the weather and is always changing. So this idea that you have a two separate elements like that, it may mean that the light goes around. It will create a building that is uh, uh, sensitive to light, to the color of the light. We use a special glass that we call low iron, extra white. It's a glass that is not greenish, it's like crystal. The malleum, the join, the structure of the glazing on the street level is actually made of cable. It's very subtle. We pull cable like in a tennis racket and you see through. So it's this idea that when you walk on the street, you can actually have a kind of visual relationship with the building. The building really is open and every corner of the building breathes. I think this is not just a little cosmetic idea, it's very much about uh, what you feel when you are inside the house. Yeah, the corner is always a nice place, but especially if you don't have the joint at the corner. If you have a piece of glass curve like that, then you stand by the corner, you are almost like uh, flying. So it's, uh, it's Manhattan, but it's also a special part of Manhattan. It's more human in some ways. The scale of building is a perfect location for a residential building. In that position, you have a fantastic view to the west, to the river. This building will have a fantastic sunset. In this profession, if you don't have a great team, you go nowhere. And very often also we have people outside from our office that we love to work with. RDI are one of those. But you know, the entire team is a great team. Without a good clients, you go nowhere. That's for sure. Because you know, it's a kind of complicity. And you know, in some way, a good client is also a quite brave client. It's a client that understands and accepts. We've been working for a long time now with David Bitsi. David understood the importance of breaking down the scale and making the building breathe. Beauty is something impossible to talk about. Uh, but the beauty I'm talking about, of course, in this case, is not cosmetics. It doesn't matter if you make a public building or private building. I think it's, it's a sense of joy. There's a sense of pride. I hope people will be proud to be there, you know. I'm living there. That's my place.